Good evening. So on the home page, there's a couple of sections like the main menu and the footer that both require you to use the editor, the theme editor. This is going to be raw code for any big commerce site. So first thing you're going to do, you're going to go to storefront. And then under my themes, you're going to go to advanced. You're going to go to edit theme files. Right. Now, these steps could vary, but for this specific cornerstone template, we're looking at templates, components, common. And then in here, you have the footer and the main navigation drop downs, right? The main navigation menu. So when you select this, it opens up a new tab. So you can open up both the, the main menu and the footer. Now, anything that is in the parentheses, a saved parentheses with a name can be changed. So all of this I would not change. Once you get down to a specific component and you can do a control find so like delivery on maui right i can do control find delivery and it should find where in this theme has delivery and once it finds it that's the word that i can change and it'll be in brackets it'll be in quotes or it'll be in something that I can specifically change. Um, so, in this section, you can see that it's finding them. When we go to the footer, this is where footer newsletter, right? So like all of these are going to be easy to find. So um, footer form, this is the subscription box, this right here subscribe to our newsletter all right here that you can change and make changes to versus as we scroll down there's going to be the privacy terms and conditions terms and conditions returns the urls are all linked in this so the place that i would change are going to be like right here for returns right? Like if I wanted to make that ret e-commerce returns or gift basket returns, I would just change it inside of that, um, but greater and less than, um, and that will continue to link to the page. Now you can see where this is linking to the page URL. So like um, with your website, right? If I go to this and then I add the forward slash area, right in here, right? And I copy and paste that into this. I will go to the exact page. So you can see where it's linking the page to the, the privacy policy. Now, if you ever change the page content, you will have to go down here and change this reference or it'll be a broken link. So the two areas that you can change pretty easily are either the words in between these or if the URLs in between that, that last part of the URL that's right here, right? That's what I would need to copy and paste in. Um, so those are the couple of areas. You could change this and not change this, but if you change this back in the page, let's say, I go to web pages and I decide to change returns when I edit this. 
Um, if I change this page URL, I need to change the page URL here. Otherwise, I'm gonna cause a broken link. I need to make sure it's not causing a broken link anywhere else. Um, so I hope that all makes sense. Um, in that area, um, that is where you can also add the same brackets to make something um, clickable, right? So that these go directly to something clickable. Um, we can do that for you too as well. So make sure if you want any of these to be clickable in that sense, as opposed to copy and paste, that we get that done before we sign off on this. But, um, and then the, if, if you change these links. So I also had someone change their Instagram channel, not notify me, and um, unfortunately it broke all their links on their site, but it also broke, um, they had an Instagram feed, broke the Instagram feed because, well, <laughs> changed the, the name. Um, so if there's any questions around making changes to this, this is in your footer section, which again, under the cornerstone version theme is under co templates, components, common, and then footer.html. So, yep, yep, right there. Um, and then there's drop downs and different navigations that you can also look into for making changes to. So, let me know in the comments below if you have any questions or you'd like to learn anything else.